Fanboy Video's coverage of Wizard World Texas is sponsored by SplashPageArt.com, the only place on the web where you can buy original pages from Lieber Mayho and other top comic artists. We love you, Ben Templesmith. We love your art. Thank you. But maybe you want to not use that word, particular word, too much, considering our previous conversation just then. But 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 I love I love everything about you oh, and your you. art. Well, thank you very much. Um, you uh, have a great presence on the web. Your Twitter account is something that I I, do. I love and I I, I, cha I look forward to it. It gets me going in the morning. And uh, your 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 mind you have brought so much to comics. And really? You you did. Well, I brought myself. That was pretty much it. So that was enough. All right. Thank you. The style That's is actually a big compliment. Thank it, you. it really is. You you really you brought. Uh, the game up, and uh, you know, people say, "Well, Ashley Wood kind of, mm, she kind of got oh, there a little bit, kind of got there a little Ash, bit." No, uh. But no, Ben Templesmith solidified it. Oh, thank you. Is that fair? So he was like runny, and I was like solid. Well, you know how they say, uh, "Well, <laughs> yes, he was running." Yes, exactly. Wherever you have an opportunity, bring things down to the gutter. That is my motto. Excellent. So. That, that reminds me, you are Australian. Yeah, I am Australian, despite the fact that I have apparently a little bit of a British accent. I'm Aussie, mate. And you're living in the United States? Yeah, living in, a, in uh, San Diego right now. Okay. So. You yeah. like it? Yeah, it's not bad. Uh, my publisher, IDW, is, is down there, so and I've got technically got an exclusive with them for another year or so. And uh, yeah, because it's part of the, the visa thing, so it's easy to have an employer. And I wanted to come to the States for a while because of the economy. <laughs> And now the economy's changed, but it's still good, because the Australian and US dollar were like one dollar for one dollar. Oh, thank you. I have birthday cake. I will eat that later. Um, that is for Mark Hay, who is bringing me out for Wizard World Texas. He's forty. And, uh, yeah, he's also a very nice man. But he's forty. Yeah, but he doesn't look it really to me. So, but yeah. You are working on the Doctor Who comic. I'm working on a Doctor Who comic. At some point in the future. But I've seen the cover. No, you have not. You have seen an image I did up a while ago that was used as a placeholder cover because I haven't done a real cover yet. But I guess the book has been solicited then because for that. But um, I can't remember for the life of me what it's called, but it, hopefully it'll be written by Leah Moore. Ah. Daughter of... Script writer. Daughter of some guy, I forget his name. But um, yeah, and... and John, Alan Moore's daughter. And also by John Rep Repian, I want to say his name, uh, is how you say it. But um, yeah, uh, I think I've just gone through the BBC approvals processes um, to approve the art, my style. That's got to be grueling. No, but it was a bit of a bit of a more involved process than usual. I was being facetious. Well, the, it's BBC and it's Doctor Who. Um, if you don't know Doctor Who, it's virtually a religion anywhere else in the world except America. No, I know what Doctor I know that. But, well, it, but they treat it. You like know, it's bigger than Jesus everywhere except America. But that, but in every, well, in the UK. But everything in everything in the UK is bigger than Jesus. So. Well, yeah, they're a very secular society, but uh, yes, but um, yeah, no. So it should be a one shot, um, and I get started on it. I guess in a, maybe a month or two. Get started like on it in a month or two. Well, whenever I get script, I haven't got script yet. Uh, I think maybe in two weeks, but I don't think it's due for me to finish for a couple of months. So, so. That's, that's, that's what you're going to start in a couple of months. What are you working on right now? I just finished Welcome to Hoxford, okay. um, which is going exceedingly well and exceeded my expectations and did, had really good sales as well as critical um, acceptance. So I'm very happy with that. Thank you very much for everyone liking Welcome to Hoxford. Um, I'm doing a Wormwood one-shot, Wormwood Gentleman Corpse, which is a collection of the first ever stories of Wormwood that I ever did, which have never been seen, and a brand new one. And that's a 32-page, literally, comic book, not mm -hmm. ads and yeah. at the back. Yeah. Ooh, am I allowed to say uh, On this one, right, Luke? You can beep it. Please beep it, because then if I say I go beep, 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 and it's really funny, because I like beeping. We'll just, we'll just bleep those. Okay, well, it makes me feel like I'm on South Park or something. Okay. Whatever makes you happy. Besides, the, besides the anal probing, you know. Um, yeah, so, and I'm doing a bunch of art book things. I'm doing a Presidents of the United States sort of portrait book with a couple of facts on each president. Interesting. Yeah, because a lot of the boring ones you've never heard of were actually quite interesting. So, uh, 
can you tease us with any other possible licensed properties that you're thinking about tinkering with at IDW? Well, if Doctor Who goes well, I'd love to do more, but then they'd have to pay me, like, more money. Really? I thought you said that you were, like, uh, you were like uh, signed uh, as an exclusive with them. Well, I'm, um, so far as my schedule goes, I'm like booked up with work until my exclusive thing ends. Ah. So then I'm not... It's a, it's like a complicated thing, but like I don't know if uh, it'd be worth their while to have me on the book longer term. But it would be a lot of work, probably anyway, for me to do. So I'm not sure if I want to do more, which is why I'm only doing a one shot first to know if I can handle doing Doctor Who. I love Doctor Who, so I'd love to do more. But it'd be nice to see if uh, I increase sales on it to a point where you go, hey, no, we need to get Ben to do it, and no one else. When you see Liam Moore as the writer and Ben Temple Smith as the artist, you're going to want to think it will be. A darker Doctor Who than maybe the TV series? I'm not Are we a, maybe I do things a little bit more atmospheric, but I'm not intentionally going to try and make this dark. I know the outline of Leah's story, and it's a really cool story that we, you would easily see as like a TV episode. Are there Daleks? No, there's no Daleks. Daleks are uh, actually sort of come under a different licensing thing as well because uh, of Terry Nation and the whole creation thing. So I think the BBC pay certain other people every time they use the Daleks. And I think the Daleks have been overused now anyway yes. for a while. So yes. we've seen enough Daleks. Sontarans, now, those are guys I can dig. Okay. That, is that an official tease? No. Okay. No, I just like them. I'm not getting to draw them. Sorry. Well, Ben Temple Smith, we love you. It is so good to see you down here in just Texas. Not sexually, right? I'm just My wife will kill me. I'm just saying, we love you. you Thank don't you. Have to think anything well, this is Texas. I don't know what that means in Texas.